Mama made me mash up all my M and M and M's. Are you ready? It's like I'm in a Dumb and Dumber movie. <laughs> what the? <laughs> oh. yeah, I'm the only smart character in the movie. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's just say that we were shopping. See, my favorite eggnog. We're gonna talk about eggnog for a minute. Okay. My favorite eggnog was three sixty five from Whole Foods. Even though I can't stand Amazon, who bought Whole Foods, I still addicted. So we're in my old neighborhood of Brentwood. And we decided to stop at the Whole Foods on San Vicente, where I used to shop. Okay. And we were looking for the 365 uh, eggnog, which they don't have. So we bought the uh, Clover Farms eggnog, which just blew my mind that it was $10 for a quart. Eight ninety nine actually. Plus tax. Still probably under 10. Let's do the math on that. Okay, 10 cents. 10 cents, okay. All right. Uh, so anyway, but I saw this. We had this chocolate milk uh, a while ago, and um, the chocolate milk was phenomenal. It was like, it was like eating high-quality melted chocolate ice cream. That's how good it was, don't you think? I haven't had it in a long time. I can't give my full opinion on it. Well, I guess it didn't leave an, uh, an impression on you. So we're going to try these. These were $5 each. Look at this. Look at this right here. But then again, you go to Starbucks, you spend seven dollars on a on a, a, a oh, peppermint mocha. Look at this, look at this right here. What? Made with whole Alexander kid eggs. What? What, what, what the hell is that supposed to mean? I can't oh, see it. Well, made, up here. made with what? Focus. Focus. All right, hold on. Press it. Let it focus. I need to focus the camera. Uh, get it back. It up. Don't worry about it. Just say what it is. It says. It's made with kids eggs. Alexander Kids Eggs? What is that? I don't know. It's certified humane. California, real California milk. USDA organic. A2A2. Certified regenerative digestible di uh, dairy. Okay, we don't want to make this, this thing, too long. This thing has four grams of protein in it. Okay, so let's just give it a shot. Come on. Funky smell. That's what egg not supposed to smell like. But it tastes great. It tastes really good. A little bit liquidy, watery. Really good eggnog is a little thicker than this. So. What the hell? Hold on, hold on. They're delicious. Okay, what do you think? Not bad. So, uh. Hey, I. Let me speak. Go ahead. Is this worth the $5? And the reason I say it, as you said, it was liquidy, correct? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I get the hint of the cinnamon as you first hit it, and then I just taste regular milk. Do you think if you put this in a pan with butter, it would be scrambled eggs? All I know, it sounds like something... It sounds like something a super fat person would do. I don't know why. <gasps> Whoa. I didn't say that. Don't you send any letters to me. I have no problem with people that are a little bit chunky. Considering the stuff you have said in the past, that would be very, very, what would, what would be the word for it? Mild. Mm. But we are in a new day and age. Anyway, um, I would say on a, on a, a one to five scale, I give this a three. That's fair, because it's a good taste, but I taste too much milk for it yes, to be eggnog. it's too liquidy. Maybe that's the kids' eggs. I don't know. We don't know. We're just, we're just consumers. We just like to spend a hard-earned money on shit like this. Uh, anyway, 365, good, they have a great, uh, a great at least they did last year. I don't know what they have this year. A great I nog. I haven't found it yet this year. Oh, yeah. Uh, and that is where we're going to end the video. <laughs> you're you're done. Okay. Uh, manage to manage to prove my point. Okay, so this is uh, Bobby and James. James is my boy. 
And uh, we just want to have some fun on uh, TikTok. The TikTok. Or the TikTok. YouTube. Or Instagram. Or Facebook. Wherever else I post this. Just to give people an escape for a minute. All right? All right. And uh, just remember, chew the cud. 23.com. Go read all my stuff. It's awesome. Right, James? This ain't a sponsored video. So I'm going to keep my mouth shut on this. We ain't sponsored, aren't we? I, uh, hold on a minute. I bought you a candy bar. And I bought you... Uh, an Alexandra, so that's sponsor enough, isn't it? I don't know. I think the author supposed to. I think the ad revenue I think was a hundred dollars per every thirty seconds, but I I don't know. I think that was what was in my contract, and I never got that. So I will. I'm going to stay silent. Cheers, fellas. We never had a contract. This was just for fun. I said I'm going to buy this, and we're going to do a video. And you said if you buy mine. If you buy mine, I'll do it with you. That's what he said. And then... See, this is why this dude's a great storyteller. Because he likes to write works of fiction. <laughs> <laughs> alright, alright. Until next time. I'm going to have to keep trying to do stuff like this. Because I need to release the demons. Until next time. Good night. Good night. And what's better than hanging out with us? Nothing. That's right.